Sand sculptors from around the country are at Siesta Beach to put their best work on display in hopes of walking away with a big prize. As in local news reporter Grant Boxleitner takes a closer look. We're here on Siesta Beach. We are at the Siesta Key Crystal Classic and thousands of people expected over the weekend to take a look at some of these elaborate sculptures. They carve and cut their ideas into a massive pile of sand. Master sand sculptors are taking over the beach at the Siesta Key Crystal Classic. Brad Stocker is building a traditional sand castle, complete with a dragon. I enjoy the architecture side of, of the sand sculpting and I usually do some form of castle and um, the crowd likes castles. A few feet away, Morgan Rudloff is putting together a music contraption of sorts. I think what inspired my partner Abe and I is um, a love for Dr. Seuss. So it's a Dr. Seuss inspired piece. Abe is a very good musician. I've recently started learning ukulele, so I'm kind of experimenting with music myself. And competitors say they like the famous white sand at Siesta Beach as their base. There's a few little shells, but there's really, it's super clean. It's really, really fine. It's nice. Visitors can get up close to the artwork while enjoying some fun, too. The first time it's ever been done where you hold a fashion show on top of a sand sculpture, so that's exciting. And the event runs Friday, Saturday, and the winner will be crowned at noon on Sunday. Reporting on Siesta Key, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News. Master sculptors are competing for $13,000 in prize money. The cost is $5 a day or $10 for all the days.